begins, which is scheduled to be any moment now. But while we wait, of course, as I said, there's been an overwhelming outpouring of sympathy and support about this shocking news. And WJZ caught up with Governor Hogan just moments ago for his reaction. Yeah, I was just uh, like everyone else. I was shocked uh, when I woke up this morning and, uh, and got the news a little before 5 a.m. this morning. And, uh, you know, my thoughts and prayers are with uh, his family, his wife and his two children and everybody who loved him. He was a, a man who dedicated his life to public service and spent decades working for the people of Baltimore County. And uh, it's a very sad day. Um, we're going to provide whatever kind of assistance we possibly can to uh, his family and to the people of Baltimore County. You know, I think um, it's it's just such a shock. All of us are in shock. We woke up this morning. Everybody around the state is in shock. We just spoke with him and his wife, Jill, and everything was good, albeit stressful. But, of course, he had a major race ahead of him, and the primaries coming up next month.